Let's talk now about RLS policies or raw level security policies that helps you to restrict the access to your tables. Disclaimer, on 99% of the cases, you need to enable the RLS policies on your table. Okay, so when you create a new table, you got here uh, enable raw level security policies by default, checked in here, okay? The RLS policies helps you to deal with the access to the table, so to get the data, to create the data, to update the data or to delete the data, okay? So once it's done, you might have trouble to get your data. Why? Because if you don't get any RLS policies enabled here, you will not able to perform operations. So here, what we want to do at first is to create a new policy. And let's say that we would like to enable read access for all users, which is cool with Superbase. It's that basically we have here now templates, which we didn't have before to uh, just deal with different cases that you would like to add to your table, okay? So the first one is to enable read access for all users. But not only here, we can see that we have insert, update, and delete. And what I'm gonna select here is the enable read access for all users. And I'm going to save this policy directly to my table orders. When we come back to Postman and we send a get method to the API, we can see that suddenly I can fetch my orders and this is because of this RLS policy we just enabled. I just added a new order with a different ID as mine and what I would like to do is just to query my own orders and not the orders from other users. And as we can see, we got two different here. We've got two different uh, users. So my orders with my ID and another user. And I'm watching the orders of this other user. How could I do to just select the order of a user, a specific user? So I'm going to come back here and I'm going to come back to my hot policy. And I need to change this enable read access for all user. Actually, I'm just going to delete it. Okay. I'm deleting this policy in here. So I'm going to create a new policy. And here in the template, I'm going to try to uh, select down here, enable users to view their own data only. Back on the orders table, if I click up here on role and I suddenly switch to anon role, we don't see the free orders anymore. We're gonna see in the next video how we're gonna use this new role feature to see what the user can see or not.